Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I thought I would share some of the running around I did yesterday. Uh, might as well dive into it. Um, I did. We went to a different Walmart because we were in a different area of town yesterday. And I'm not going to show you the cat food or possibly the two things of discounted stuff from the deli that definitely wasn't keto. Uh, but I will show you. Uh, has anyone else noticed with their Walmarts, it might just be here because they're renovating, um, the drink squeezies, they're not replenishing them. Like, they're not, they're not phasing them out. They're just not stocking them, I guess, while they're working on stuff. So that's why we stopped this one to see if they had something different. They had fruit punch and I'll be your huckleberry. Uh, okay, I apologize. This tastes like Blueberries. It's actually really good. Uh, these were on clearance for like a buck each, so I was very happy because those are the big ones in comparison to the normal size, you know? Um, I've also been looking for that. And they had it. I was so very happy. So I got it. It tastes awesome. It's not watery. It is a little carby. I, I wouldn't douse my food in it for two tablespoons, but you know what? For a little seasoning on something, not going to hate it. Um, yeah, that was all from Walmart, so let me get on to the next thing. Next up is our scratch and dent type of store. I call it a grocery outlet, but apparently there's a chain with that name. It's not like that. Uh, I've explained before, they buy pallets of stuff that are put on auction from other stores, That uh, the items that are past their sell-by, but not past their best-by, and various other things. So... This, uh, this is actually sort of uh, an example of over, over two days. We, we hit, there's two locations here. We hit them both just to see because sometimes one has stuff the other doesn't like. The one we hit yesterday actually had ground turkey. The first one did not. So they apparently got a ton of this stuff, right? Now, you know, it's one carb. I should turn the light back on. Battery's getting low. One carb for, you know, in the mouth <laughs> or on the jello, you know. Um, you got six free cans if you spent five dollars. We have twelve cans in the fridge. Just saying. Um, not pictured as usual are cat food, uh, dry cat food and some pouches. You, you know, some nice stuff that in the regular store the bags probably would have gone for fifteen twenty dollars. I got for you know like five six. Um, let's see. Got a couple. A couple of these, these were, I think he told me when he picked it up, like a buck fifty for, I think it's a pound? Yep, it's an actual pound. So, got that in the fridge. I like to, ground turkey on its own, I never have much luck using in stuff that always tastes like ground turkey. But if I take this and t take some of our 73% hamburger and cook it all together, then the good fat goes into the turkey as well and works out perfect for, like, chili and things like that. Um... Got a couple of these, as you can see from the tag, what the price was. Uh, the other day, my darling found these as well. I know cashews aren't the best for carbs, but you know what? Trying to make slightly better choices? That's a better choice. Bunch of the brown gravies. I know, I know, I know. Bad on the carbs. But I don't use very much, and I can fake myself out making a sort of a keto egg foo young and use a little bit of that. And... Hits the spot. And they were 50 cents. No, they were four for a dollar. So well, I stocked. <laughs> I stocked. Um, I won't buy creamy dressings from there, but I will buy a vinaigrette uh, any day of the week, all day. 50 cents. Mm, we all know how much cans cost. Same with whenever we find them, we buy them. They only had hot and mild. So we got it. Um, the second location we went to, I mean, the first one had them too, but I actually picked them up. Day. They were not $3. I believe everything was 50 cents in the bid. So I got a couple fireballs because they do crack after a while, especially the ones from the dollar store. So, And some sponges. Again, 50 cents. This was my nice find. You know, we all love the red tea. Oh, I just saw it says sweetened. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is going to go somewhere else. Ignore that. Although, I may... I need to pay closer attention. It was only two bucks. I'm not out a whole lot. Hmm. Darn. I, was, I need to pay closer attention. But I know who I can give it to. Allie. Um. I'm saying I'm a lot again. Mm, cat food. Yes. Okay. Next. 
I had forgotten about this. Light on. Uh, we had picked it up two days ago as well. It's a buck twenty-five. There are the drink packets, and they also had protein bars, all kinds of them. They were like twenty for a dollar. Yep, that means that they're on their way up. But twenty for a dollar, we picked and rooted and picked and got Quest bars and Atkins bars. We were pleased with that. Okay, I think I'll do this in ships. Uh, he got some. Chewy caramels. I have not seen the pumpkin spice ones yet. I'm on the lookout. Uh, a couple of drink additives. I know they can be a little carby, but we mix them in almost a gallon of water sometimes for one pouch, and it's very nice. He found I got 50 cents. He bought like four or five, six of them. We went to a different Dollar Tree, one that I've never personally been to. It was out in about 20 minutes outside of town in the foothills for us locals. So there were some different things like it's beautiful. It's purple skulls. Now I know what you're thinking, Autumn. This looks like crafty stuff, and you would be right because I'm going to be doing a challenge, and I have actually some crafty ideas. So I got that. I need to find some Mod Podge. I got one of these metallic marker pens, and a couple. Of these spoon rest trivet things in two different sizes and shapes. You have to stay tuned to see what I'm going to do with those. And then a little on the mundane. I picked up a couple of razors. There's five in there. I figure with the way my skin is, my legs are going to bleed no matter what I use. So only the best for this girl. Uh, my darling got some sticks. Some... Yes, I have words in my head and they exist. Dental floss, because every time he puts his down in the bathroom, one of these cats, usually that one over there, steals it. Um, he, he likes these, who doesn't? He has some rubbing alcohol, this one. He's apparently got something in mind. He got that. Uh, he, he grabbed a couple, because this is one of his favorite smells. And he says, look what I learned on TikTok. Ready for it? Ready for it? Anyone else do this to open it? I did not even know! Look at that! Look at that! Okay. Um, num, 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 num. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. Okay. He found the child. Anyone else excited? It's coming back next month! And I got some harvest candles! Because my usual Dollar Tree that I go to hasn't had these out yet! And they actually smell good enough that I can smell them through my cloth mask. Okay, I think that was everything from the Dollar Tree. I'm thinking mm, we're not going to mention the, you know, because I may or may not be. <laughs> it's been one. Um, also, those peanut butter chocolate. Oh, hold on. Again, not keto. Don't come for me. But sometimes when you see a deal and you just can't resist, you pick it up. I know we're naughty, we're naughty, we'll probably end up giving them to his folks, but that was everything I got at the Dollar Tree, and then we made one more stop. Okay, light on. We stopped at a Dollar General. Now, locals know, if you live in town, your closest Dollar Generals are going to be going either an hour to San Luis, or out to the foothills, and I just haven't done it. So we were out there. I'm like, I want to go. So these are the things I picked up. I tried not to spend too much. That was hard. Um, but they had some little solar dancers. I love these. They're going outside. These little figures. Can you see? The little skeleton. The she skeleton. The witch. This a welcome thing. The dusty broom pan thing. Pumpkin spice chai. Again, I could smell it through my mask. It's a winner. Um, I always look at the drink stuff. I know I've seen the grab and grape in other places, but I have not seen the mashin mango melon. Again, we put one of these in almost a gallon of water, so it spreads out the carbs. The thing I spent the most money on in the whole store was for my darling. Look at that. It's one of those cups. And it was only... That says eight bucks, but I want to say I got it discounted. That is it. That is it. Yes. Wow. 
Okay. So that was basically the day of running around all the different stores and buying all the things that I probably didn't need to buy, but it made me feel good. So now, I'm going to get ready for the rest of my evening here in a moment. But I wanted to get this filmed and get the stuff put away. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Again, wildfires aren't anywhere near here, but our air quality by it's a big one. Uh, to anyone who's in the way of these fires, in the way of the hurricanes, the tropical storms, basically everyone be careful and be safe. Because it's nuts out there. <sighs> it is so nuts out there. Okay. Those cats are playing. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop so that way I can compile this later after I plug my phone in. Okay. Be safe, and thanks for watching. If you like this, hit the thumbs up. Subscribe. All the things I never think to say. And I will see you all next time. Blessed be, everybody.